Jerry Lee. J Rock has come back to you too. What is happening in here? In 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 with the millions and millions of J Rock's fans from all over the world. You're right here with J Rock, and we got ourselves another Cold War Call of Duty trailer. Many folks are saying that this trailer or this game is about the upcoming election. Maybe it is. Maybe it ain't. But. Be that as it may, Call of Duty is taking us to the Cold War. So, this is the Perseus briefing. Okay. All right. Well, Call of Duty, let's see what you got. 1943. Detailed information from the Manhattan Project was stolen from Los Alamos by the Russian spy known as Perseus. 1968, Vietnam War. Viet Cong soldiers orchestrated by Perseus attempted to steal an American-made nuclear bomb from a U.S. fire base. Five days ago, while on a mission, we acquired intel that Perseus is in play again and planning an attack on the West. Perseus, the CIA's analysts consider him to be the single largest threat free world. Mr. Hudson, we're all aware of Perseus. We're also aware he's more myth than fact. I mean, personally, I think he's nothing more than the Russian boogeyman. General Haig, allow me to introduce the man I suited to respond to that. CIA clandestine special officer Russell Adler. He's one of the few people who even come close to capturing Perseus. Uh, Mr. Adler, why should we take this Perseus threat seriously? You don't have to, sir. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, but then a lot of innocent people are gonna die. Why do you say that? Sir, every time Perseus has come into play, it's shifted the balance of the Cold War. After 13 years of silence, if he's active, something big is gonna happen. Something that will affect the free world. Mr. President. Mr. President, this is Jason Hudson and Russell Adler. I know their names. Who do you think approved their last mission? Hmm. There he is. Is the threat real? Yes, sir, we believe it is. Can you stop Perseus? We can, sir. I've already submitted the requisition for my team. Sir, their requests are highly irregular. Most likely illegal. If the press gets a hold... What the hell are you talking about? You know who we are? Every mission we go on is illegal. Sergeant Woods, plausible deniability is the backbone of our work. Al, yep. we're talking about preventing an attack on the free men and women of the world. Give Mr. Adler whatever he wants. Gentlemen, you've been given an important task, protecting our very way of life from a great evil. There is no higher duty. There is no higher honor. And while few people will know of your struggles, rest assured, the entire free world will benefit. I know you won't fail us. Pre-order a digital copy and get early access to the open beta and instant access to the Woods Operator Pack in Modern Warfare, including Warzone. It's one thing. Oh, J-Rock says this, none other than Mr. Plausible Deniability himself. Former President Mr. Reagan is in this game. And they got Perseus. I keep thinking of Perseus from the Clash of the Titans, the son of Zeus, or half-son of Zeus, Perseus. The remake that came out about 10 years ago was actually pretty good. Anyway, but that's not the point. What J-Rock is saying is that of all the Call of Duty games, this might be the very first time where I'm actually paying close, close attention to the storyline of the game. Most Call of Duty games are just getting in for the action. Not really all that concerned about the actual story. This one, 
probably gonna be the first one where I actually sat back and like watched what happened. But be that as it may, um, this game. I can't wait to see the actual game play, but that is coming down the road soon. So, stay tuned for that. Post comments down below. Let your rock know what you thought of his reaction to this video. No rhyme intended on that line. And if you enjoyed the great one's reaction to this, hit that like button, subscribe, and share. And make sure to hit that bell so you can be notified that it is time to be electrified. Thank you for joining J-Rock. Until we meet again. Mamba and Gigi forever. If you smell, J Rock.